Whoa. Hello. Today, I have two books to show you. Like I said in my previous video, I'm wearing the same t-shirt because I am recording, I think, three videos. Yeah, I've recorded three videos today. Basically, one after the other. So the first one was my review of Monument 14. Which you can go and check out if you like. If you like it, go and check it out. Um, it's going to be a book haul, quick book haul. Um, and then the next video will be something else. Okay? Okay? Just saying. Ugh. Right, so, second video. Let's go on with it. Book haul. Today, I've got two books. Two very hyped up books I'm extremely excited for. One of them, I just couldn't wait to get it. Because the hardback doesn't come out for a couple of days. And I was like, oh, I need this book in my life. And the other book... I will explain. So, the first book I will explain about. So, I reserved The Eye of Minds by James Dashner on, uh, this is the guy that wrote, wrote the Maze Runner series, which is the Maze Runner, I don't know if I'm getting them in the right order. It's the Maze Runner, Scorch Trials, Death Cure, Kill Order? Maybe? I'm not sure. I'm getting those books soon in brand new covers, which look amazing, by the way. So you'll see those very soon. Yeah, yes. Probably on Saturday, maybe Sunday you'll see those. But anyway, uh, yeah, so I reserved this online with the Waterstones app. Not the app, sorry. On the website, because apparently the app's been down and they're making improvements to it, but it's been like that for like three or four weeks and it's really, really annoying. But anyway, so I reserved this online at waterstones.co.uk uh, for $9.99. With, and like, if you reserve stuff, click and collect on Waterstones, you get them cheaper. So it actually came to, because I click and collected, I said £2.50, so I think it came to like £7.50. So that was cool. But then... I go into Waterstones to collect these two books, like, and this book as well, which you'll see in a minute. So I went into the Waterstones to collect them, and I saw that on the counter, they had, like, about 30 of these, and a sign that said, now only 5 99 5 99 What? <laughs> what? So I go up to the guy there, yeah, and I'm like, oh, I reserve the Eye of Minds by James Dashner and this other book, blah, blah, blah. Uh, you know, but I see you've got 5 99 ones here, and the one that I reserve is going to cost me £7.49. And he was like, don't worry about it, it's cool, you can have a 5 99 one. And I was like, what? This book for 5 99 I need it. They're picked to dark. No, no. Now this is book one in James Dashner's new series, which I think is called the Mortality or the Morality Doctrine. There's book one, which is The Eye of Minds, which has, I think, this British cover, especially the hardcover, I think is so much nicer than the American. One, because the American one is just sh too shiny, really shiny. <clears throat> Pardon me. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know if I'm in too close here. God, where has he gone? Oh, but that... Oh, there he is. It has a really cute guy on the cover. Oh, God, he's so cute. Seriously, I don't know if you can see him. Up close. Oh, he's really cute. Really cute. And I love this cover. It's really nice. On the back it says, here, welcome to the Vertnet, a world beyond your wildest dreams and your worst nightmares, dot 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 dot, suspense, suspense, and spiders, beautiful, and I always like to show under the dust jacket, so you know, under the dust jacket it's just plain black, and it says on the side, James Dashner, the Eye of Minds, publisher, Doubleday, 
And I'll redo the inside flap. Let me see if I re need to redo something. No, that's about Dame James Dashner. Um. Okay, cool. So, the inside flap. To catch a hacker, you need a hacker. For Michael and the other gamers, the vert net can make their fantasies become real. And the more hacking skills they have, the more fun. Who wants to play by the rules anyway? But some rules were made for a reason. One gamer has been taking people hostage inside the vert net with horrific consequences. The government needs Michael to track down the rogue gamer, but the risk is enormous and the line between game and reality could be blurred forever. Ba -ba -ba! That sounds incredible. And it's a hardback, which is amazing because I love hardbacks. Love it. Yeah, so like I said, this, this sounds a bit like, uh, oh, what's it called? Insignia by S.J. Kincaid. Sounds a bit like that. Which I read and took me ages to get into. I did like it, but I didn't pick up the second one, Vortex, because I was just like, oh, I don't want to take forever to get into that video, uh, to get into that book. Anyway, yes. And like I said, this is book one in the Morality Doctrine series. And the second book, The Rule of Thoughts, comes out in about... Ah, it's gone, it's gone. I didn't know it. I forgot. But it comes out soon, actually. Not too long. I think maybe three or four months, something like that. So, yes, I'm looking forward to reading this one. And picking up the rule of thoughts when it comes out. I think this is split into sections. Uh, let me just have a look. The Eye of Mind. I always like reading dedications. This dedication is really nice as well. Uh, I read your dedication from... I think it was Marina. No. I read your dedication from The Humorist by Russell Kane. Because I love dedications. This one says... This book is dedicated to Michael Burrett and Krista Marino for making my career and for being good friends. Oh, I just love dedications. Okay. I don't think it's split into sections. Oh. What? Oh, no, there's different parts to the chapters. So, like, as you can see, hopefully, chapter one is called The Coffin, and then there's part one of chapter one. And I'll show you. See? Part two of chapter one. And that continues all the way through the book. But anyway, yes, I'm really excited to get into this one. I'll stop yabbering on so I can show you the next one. <sighs> Sorry. Next book I have. I am so excited. I can't even tell you how much excitement I feel. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not even going to try and tell you. I'm just going to gonna get on with it. Yeah. So basically, I wanted this book forever. Since I actually saw the video, I saw Twitter channel, Twitter channel, yes. I saw Heather from Twitter channel and Bookables talking about this book in a This Week in YA New Release Tuesday video a while ago and I thought I have to get it. I went on Waterstones, I went to look at the hardback, it was published in it be a few weeks and I thought okay cool I'll wait for it to come out in hardback no no okay sometimes Waterstones messes up because this book has actually been in paperback for a while okay okay it's been in paperback for a while uh for some reason it's coming out in paperback first and then being published in hardback on Monday I think in the UK so weird anyway this is the one i'm most excited for and i'm going to show you it because i want to stop chatting about it and just show you it it's amazing and it is drum roll please maybe no more drum rolls sorry half bad by sally green look at the oh oh my god
Is that not the most beautiful book cover you have actually ever seen in your life? I think it is. It's fucking amazing. And this bit, <coughs> the half bad, is actually like proper 3D. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, it's so amazing. But it gets better. Watch this. Sorry. Watch this. What? It's exactly the same on the back, but in white. How is this book so gorgeous? I mean, that cover, that, that is beautiful. That is amazing. If the hardback, <coughs> sorry, the hardback is silver and red. If the hardback was this, what? What? Really? Let me just show you. Oh, so beautiful. And the spine. Lovely. Lovely spine. And it's all like inverted, which is really cool. Anyway, so I'll read you about this because I can't wait for it. Oh, crap. I forgot where the synopsis is. It's not a very big synopsis, you know. It doesn't give much away. <coughs> but it says, you can't read, can't write, but you heal fast, even for a witch. You get sick if you stay indoors after dark. You hate white witches, but love Annalise, who is one. You've been kept in a cage since you were 14. All you've got to do is escape and find Mercury, the black witch who eats boys. And do that before your 17th birthday. Easy. Ugh. How amazing is a little synopsis? Oh, it sounds... Oh. I don't get it. It sounds amazing. How can it be so amazing? And there are, uh, uh, sorry, there are six parts to this book, which is really cool. Uh, it's quite a big book, to be honest. Like, it's not. <coughs> it's not. Uh, it's not a short book. Sorry. See, look. If you look at that, that's actually quite big. I'll tell you how many pages. Exactly Monday. It is. Oh, no, that's an acknowledgement. In total, reading pages, it's about 370, which is quite a massive book. Nearly 400 pages. So, yeah, that's half bad. Well, actually, there's another little synopsis thing here. It says, Nathan Byrne is half bad. He's half white witch, half black witch. His mother was a healer. His father is a killer. He's wanted by no one, but hunted by everyone. <laughs> yeah. And in the back, it says the sequel is coming out spring 2015. And it's called Half Wild. Oh yeah, and I suppose the cover on this one is going to be amazing as well. Just as Nathan's story continues in Half Wild, coming spring 2015. And it's supposed to be an amazing amazing book and I hope it is that because anyways I bought it for nothing but it's part of a new series I don't know if it's a trilogy I think it might be but I know there's definitely more coming out because obviously there's half bad and then it says half wild is coming out spring next year I don't know what the last one's going to be called maybe it'll be something like half evil oh yeah half good Half dead. That is kill Tara. Oh god, imagine this. Half dead. And this red bit. Yeah, the red bit, like a skull. What? <laughs> what? Really? Oh my god. I might just tweet Sally Green. Mm, yeah. Might tweet her and suggest her. Be like, have you got a title for the third book? Have you got a title, love? Because if you haven't, listen up. Listen here. We'll meet up. We'll have a coffee. We'll discuss. And you can pay me royalties. <laughs> no, it's never going to happen. Anyway, I'll stop yabbering on, but I'm really excited to read this. And it has one of the most amazing covers I've ever seen in my life. Yes. So... These are the two books I got. I'm extremely excited to read them. Let me know if you've read them, if you have them, if you're excited to read them, if you like them, if you didn't like them. 
let me know down below and go check out Twia channel because they're epic they're epic okay sorry this is the end of my second video today and i'm now going to go and record my third section so i will see you later bye bye